Hey, what's up everyone? It's Immortal here. I'm bringing you a uh, StarCraft 2 commentary. And this is a pretty short game, honestly. So you might be seeing some rushes here. And in the top right is Root Kiwi Kaki. Kaki. Ah. Uh, with this awesome little uh, AP, uh, a, I forgot, APM, yeah. And in the bottom left is Quop. Quop. And we are playing in Zelnaga Caverns. So, uh, no GG from any players right now. We might be seeing one. Checking out for some little cheesy kind of cannon play. Doesn't look like it. Actually going to wall off with his pylon. I wouldn't suggest it for most for most Protoss players. I would put it back here. So the pylon does not go down so easily. And just put the gateway and then the cybernetic score. Uh, that's what I did. That's what I did like a while ago. So yeah, I, I think it's a pretty good strategy or a little plan right there. So here goes Quad making his first gateway at 12. Pretty very, 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 uh, very, very usual for every Protoss player. Quad, you know, just zapping around, that, zapping away at this pylon. A simulator going down. Uh, another pylon coming over here. No, a probe, not a pylon, a walking pylon. Or a zooming pylon, I should say. Chrono boost. Gateway almost finishing. Uh, Quap with his gate. I just love saying that. Quap. Quap. Or Q O P. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong. Quap. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call him Quap. Sorry if I'm wrong, but. Alright. There you go. Not, nothing really cheesy going on right now. Pretty orthodox play right now. Putting down a cybernetic card sh short after after the gateway. But for Quap, his cybernetic core is a bit delayed. But I don't think it would matter uh, way too much. Both got 17 harvesters. Uh, units lost. None, of course, unless they, someone lost a someone lost a you know a unit or a probe and I cannot believe this probe got this pylon down so much it's only like 240 more till this dies and here goes the policeman running towards that to take care of that one vigilante probe and corona boosting out this gateway tech pretty standard actually not standard to corona boost it out and spoke a bit too soon Go for two more barracks? No, gate gateways. Yeah, I was getting everything wrong today. Uh, sorry about that, guys, but I'm getting everything wrong today. Alright. Well, Quap not producing much with no gateways coming, no no tech buildings. Just a pylon and gateway tech. Two more gateways going down for Rue Kiwikaki or Kiwikaki. Stalker just scouting out around. You see this stalker kill the probe poor probe let's have a funeral for that probe someday someday guys and uh pylon going down for rookie wukaki some some proxy pylon going around here probably planning to warp in some units while very close to the enemy's base uh and a quap stalker's going out right now he's yeah, going out for a date nah two gay stalkers i'm uh, gonna be warping in stalkers no zealots and this is this is what I like this is the kind of gameplay I like like to make great gateways to make warp gates and then make a proxy pile and then warp close to the base so you don't so you don't have the walk time to actually have to walk before you, you can do damage and Quap is gonna get this pylon probably no three more warping in they're gonna be forced to retreat and three more warping in for Quap but I, I think Quap is in a pretty bad position right now. Six, five stalkers versus two stalkers. Very good micro by Kiwakako. Not very good, but good micro. And just going all in with his probes. I think this will be GG for Quap. Kiwakako looks pretty strong in this place. Two, three more stalkers is warping in at full health. These two at full health too. Gonna focus down one. Gonna focus down the other one. GG, mate. Good luck. And there's the GG.
Kiwi Kaki does not say GG back, but that's alright. I guess he just left a bit too early. Well, uh, pretty short video. Whoops. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe, please rate, please comment, and I'll see you guys next time.